Good morning everyone. Today we will discuss an important topic in railway engineering kinds of estimates in railway projects. Estimates play a crucial role in financial planning, ensuring that every project whether new or existing is systematically approved and funded. This lecture will help you understand the classification and importance of railway estimates. Definition of estimates. Estimates are financial assessments prepared before undertaking any railway work. They help in proper allocation of funds, approval from relevant authorities, monitoring and controlling project costs, ensuring financial accountability. Railway projects require different types of estimates based on the nature of work and its cost. Categories of estimates. One construction or purchase of new works or assets. This includes setting up new railway lines, bridges, stations, locomotives, and other essential infrastructure. New constructions are carefully planned to ensure feasibility and economic benefits. Proper estimates help in securing funding from the appropriate sources. Two renewals and replacements. Over time, railway assets deteriorate due to wear and tear. Assets such as tracks, bridges, and signalling systems need renewal and replacement. If these works are funded from the depreciation fund, development fund, or open line works revenue, estimates are mandatory if they exceed fifty thousand rupees. If funded from revenue, an estimate is required if the cost exceeds five lakhs rupees. Three scrapping, dismantlement, or abandonment. Assets that are no longer useful or safe must be scrapped, dismantled, or abandoned. This helps in optimizing resource utilization and avoiding unnecessary maintenance costs. Proper estimates are required before executing such actions to justify the financial and operational impact. Four reconditioning of existing works or assets. Some assets can be reconditioned instead of being replaced entirely. If the cost of reconditioning is more than one lakh rupees, an estimate must be prepared. Similarly, any repair work chargeable to revenue costing over five lakh rupees requires approval. For a single housing unit, repairs need an estimate if the cost exceeds twenty thousand rupees. Five temporary and experimental works. Sometimes railway projects require temporary structures or experimental installations. These works are undertaken to test feasibility before making permanent investments. Proper estimates ensure control expenditure and avoid unnecessary financial burden. Six renewals and replacements on worked lines. These include renewals required on active railway sections. Worked lines need constant upkeep to ensure smooth and safe railway operations. Replacements may include track components, electrical systems, and station facilities. Seven renewals of ballast. Ballast is the crushed stone or material used to support railway tracks. Regular renewal is essential for maintaining track stability and smooth operations. Estimates for ballast renewal are included in maintenance planning to ensure continued safety. Summary of key points. Railway estimates categorize works based on type and cost. Estimates help in financial planning, approval, and execution of projects. Various thresholds are defined for different types of works. In conclusion, estimates play a crucial role in railway project management. By following proper estimation procedures, we ensure efficient use of resources, financial discipline, and long-term railway development. Thank you. Let me know if you have any questions or need further clarification. Proper estimation helps in resource optimization and infrastructure sustainability.